It's about that time for me to get my annual Christmas fix. What is up you guys? My name is Kira if you are new. Welcome back to another vlogmas video. Today you guys I am sharing with you my annual Christmas fix and let me tell you how it is Thursday December 23rd at 4 27 Central Standard Time and I plan on having this up around 7 30 today like in three hours so I have to go ahead and hurry up and film this fix for you this is what I had on my schedule for today and I've had this box sitting in my room for a couple of days now but I'm trying just to like tie up loose ends I've been finishing Christmas shopping today not Christmas shopping wrapping rather well no that's not true I did do a little bit of Christmas shopping like um we put in like a H-E-B pickup for a couple of cannolis. I felt like I couldn't have Christmas dinner or Christmas dessert without a couple of cannolis and a couple of rainbow cookies. And I tried to get some baked clams. I'm hoping that they are going to be available. And Paul wanted a black cherry soda for his black cherry noir vodka. So not really like Christmas things, but still things we needed for Christmas day. So we were doing that today. And then I needed like laundry detergent and stuff. And and we never got a chance to do the Target pickup that we were supposed to do on the way to Vanessa's on Tuesday because we were running late. And so I have to go and take care of that today. So just a few like last minute things, but we were like cleaning up and baking and stuff and just trying to, like I said, tie up all the loose ends so that we can just relax for the next couple of days. And before I knew it, I looked at the time and I was like, whoa! I am not going to screw up Vlogmas now. We are like this close to being done and I am on a roll. So that's it. Like we're going to get into this box right now. So I have been doing Stitch Fix now for, I want to say it's been like four, four and a half years or so. Almost everything I own at this point is Stitch Fix and it's because the quality of their clothes is just amazing. I was wearing my new north face pants that i got for my last fix and then my sweater like a cable knit sweater that i got last year in my christmas fix that's what i wore to like our little friends miss oliver hey he is trying to eat the plastic garbage bag that i have in my room because a can of cat food is in there so he's eating through the plastic so that he can lick lick the can okay so I wore that outfit to Vanessa's and I said this is one of my favorite outfits like it's my favorite sweater those are definitely my new favorite pants even for Christmas my mom got me the pair same pants in olive and in mauve because they offered that on Stitch Fix like just to purchase them and so like that's what she got me for Christmas because I love the pants so much so I told her like this is the ultimate for me like I feel put together on top but I'm like all comfort on the bottom and that's just it it's all of my favorite clothes are from Stitch Fix so it just is what it is and I look forward to it if you guys have never tried Stitch Fix before I'll leave my link in the description box you guys get $25 plus it, they waive your styling fee so you pay $20 every single time that the stylist will style you but if you keep any pieces they just credit that 20 bucks towards what you purchase and so if you click my link then you save 25 dollars off your order plus you they waive your styling fee so you essentially get a piece for free which you kind of can't beat that because usually the average shirt is about 25 to 30 bucks depending on what you choose now when you first sign up for stitch fix they do like a little style quiz and they ask you a bunch of questions like your likes your dislikes you can veto whether or not maybe you don't like leopard print but you love floral or vice versa you can go through all of that they'll even share with you outfits and you say like yes to that outfit 
outfit or no to that outfit so they can kind of get to know you a little bit better and your stylist can get a feel for your style so she knows how to style you. Just as of recently, they have where they send you now a preview of your fix. And so you can get it in the app where they'll just send you a little push notification that says, hey, your fix is ready to be viewed. And they'll send you more than the five pieces. And you can kind of go through and select your five or you can just select two or one or none. like. This particular time I selected none and I was very, very upset with them and it's only because for ever, whatever reason, they stopped giving me my same stylist. I've been using Kelly since I had that whole Stitch Fix mishap. So if you guys missed that video, I'll link it. It's like one of my most viewed videos of all time because it was like a Stitch Fix fail. They sent me ridiculous pieces that were crazy expensive, things I would never buy, all things out of my price point because you also can specify how much you would be willing to pay on bottoms, tops, accessories, whatever. And everything was out of my price range. It was awful. And from that moment on, they gave me Kelly. And I've been using Kelly for, like I said, four years. And I love her. And then as of last time, they didn't give me her. And if it wasn't for Vanessa buying a few pieces that I wasn't going to buy, I, it wouldn't have been a five for five. She kind of bought all of those pieces that I wouldn't purchase. And then they sent me this one and it was shorts and tank tops and short sleeves. And I said, I know that I live in Texas because you can write back your feedback. I chose no pieces and then it says like what was the problem with this and so I wrote back and said I don't know what your guys's problem is but you ask at the end if we want to keep our stylist and as long as Kelly's still working why don't I have her because I've been using her and I want to keep her and she knows me and she writes me little notes every time and so I want her back and otherwise I don't it doesn't make any sense to me why I'm getting all of these like crazy things this is not what I want I know I live in Texas and it's 75 80 degrees but I don't want short sleeves and shorts right now so they sent me a whole brand new fix I don't know who I have we're going to read my note but don't let those I'm glad I never let that stitch fix fail like discourage me because I've had pretty much nothing but success since then. I very rarely send back a piece. I love what they send me and like I said my whole closet is filled with stitch fix clothes. So I'm going to share with you what they sent to me. Read you the little note. I don't go over prices until the end. I'll try everything on and then we will decide. So they always send you back a mailer. You never pay for shipping either. Either way um, I usually throw this out because I never need it because I never stinking send anything back but you also could send things back for size so if you try something on and you love it but it's too big or too small you can play with sizes also but I don't know I've never really been dissatisfied with it unless it was a hand select few times so to me this is definitely you know something that's worth it so let's read my note maybe they found me Kelly nope it's Julie so I don't know uh, your style delivered. Hi, Kira. I'm so happy you've enjoyed building a friendship with Kelly over the last three years, but unfortunately, she is no longer with the company. I look forward to partnering with you and continuing to add to your beautiful clothing collection. Thanks so much for previewing your fix, and I'm so sorry the items weren't seasonally appropriate. Your fix is part of a test we're conducting, and apparently it was not successful. My apologies. I switched gears and chose some new weather-appropriate options that I hope you'll enjoy. Since you have some several great pairs of leggings. I thought you might like the joggers from TFT, which is a thread for thought, and I love them. They have the skinny fit you rock so well, plus they have the budget-friendly price you prefer. Pair them with the Nine Britain top for a chic, cozy look this winter. Best Julie. All right, so I guess I'm not getting Kelly back, like I said, um, unless she didn't work for the company. I didn't understand why I wasn't getting her. So I guess she no longer works for the company. That's super sad. She really knows me. I'm hoping that Julie gets to know me really well because whatever that they did wasn't working. But let's see what she sent to me. Ooh, is this a cardigan? Oh, yeah. This looks good and cozy. I don't really own cardigans like this. But this is really, really nice. I love this. I love the like print of this. Does it have a hood? Oh no, but it's like a bulky collar. I like that. And then it has like the big chunky button. And then that's 
the bottom detail. Hmm. I really like that. I'm not a huge cardigan person. That's more Vanessa, but we'll see how it works out for me. Hmm. Okay, so this is just a, a oh, it's a racer back. Okay. I'm not a huge fan of the racer backs just because when I wear a bra and stuff, but hmm, that's pretty neat. Look at the way the racer back is. So it's a racer back. But the shirt still goes over it. So like there's, depending on how it falls, you might not see your bra. Hmm, I'm curious about that. But this definitely looks different and comfy. Okay, we'll have to try it on. Most of the time I see things and I'm like, hmm, I don't know how I feel about it. And then I put it on and I'm like, okay, I'm in love. Okay, but this I'm going to be in love with. Oh, yeah, she said nine Britain top. That This is the one. Okay, yeah, this is like, oh, I wish I lived somewhere where I could wear this all of the time. You guys, this is almost like fleece. So cozy, and I love the colors. The mauve to the white to like the charcoal gray. Really, really love that sweater. Like, really love that sweater. Oh, yeah, that that's definitely me. So I'm excited to try that on. Oh, I like this blue color. Oh, it's like a hoodie kind of thing. Okay, that speaks to me. Oh, it's like a football style. You know, with like the, when they do the little, um, oh, it's not football style, sorry. It was just caught. Okay, so it's just, it is like a, what do you call it? You know, you can pull it tight. It's got that. And then that's the, whoa. All right, I'm not doing a very good job of sharing this stuff with you. I'll show you more once it's on. But those are the sleeves. Again, super soft. That's one thing I always say about Stitch Fix clothes is that the texture of them always feels so cozy that everything you're always wearing always feels like you get what you pay for, if that makes any sense. And then, oh, these are nice. These are the Thread for Thought Joggers. And they're almost like, see how you can see? They almost look tie-dye, not tie-dye, but like weathered or worn and good. They're not super tight on the bottom. I hate the ones that are like really tight. Yeah, see, you can see how it's almost like distressing, but not like holes. All right. All right, so it's not, uh, it's not actually, actually not so bad. Uh, it was really, really bad before, but this, this is good. So let me go and try these on. I'm going to put the joggers on, and as long as they fit and they're comfy, I can just try on all the tops right with those a pair of pants. So I'm going to move you guys up. Hopefully the lighting is okay, because like I said, it's stupid late right now. And let's go ahead and try these on and see how I make out. All right, you guys, so the joggers fit, so I'll share those with you in just a second. I just have a tank top on. I always have, like, some kind of layering piece underneath. Oh, you guys. This is, like... Sorry, V. I know you said if I got a cardigan, you wanted it. I think you're out of luck. I don't really own one, though. I got one... A lot, like in one of my first fixes and it's like orange so I wear it in the fall but that's really it but oh yeah this one is super super cozy I'm gonna turn the camera down well you guys can kind of see from there but I have my mirror here so I'll share with you guys a little bit in the mirror um, also like what the joggers look like like I said I have a tank on underneath and then um, here, why don't you guys come with me in the mirror so that you can see what I'm looking at. And don't look at my messy mirror because my daughter put some kind of something on there that I can't get off. All right, so these are the joggers. Don't mind my mom tummy and stretch marks. Um, I didn't even tie this because I just put this on really quickly. Um, I love all the thread for thought because they're good. Um, they always have a lot of room and I feel like they're always super comfy. They have pockets and yeah, I'm 
definitely content with the way that they feel. They have like a stripe, but it's not so much a stripe. If you can see, it's just like a texture difference, but it's the same color, but that's kind of cool because it makes the pant leg look a little different. And then the cuff here at the bottom, let me share with you what the cuff looks like. Yeah, we're doing this real, real vlog style, you guys. Let's vlog mess, right? Um, so you can see that it still has those, but it's enough. It almost reminds me of, what would you call those? Like, not parachute pants, but like Aladdin pants, kind of. And then let's just stop and take a minute to look at this super cozy and wonderful cardigan. Like, I just love this so, so, so much. Yes. I definitely think that I can see myself wearing this one all of the time. All right, so now you guys kind of saw the pants and the whole look. Like, we pretty much can just change tops right from here, but I think I'm gonna move you guys back up so that you're more on my level look miss vanessa she's been painting all the ceramics you got her one for all of you guys all right so let's try that racer back tee it looks really cozy i just see myself needing to use it as a layering piece because i don't feel like this is something i could wear just by itself because of that back but yeah this is good and loose fitting I'm, very, I'm all about the loose look right now because I'm back to like the heaviest that I've ever been and that just annoys me because I worked so hard for so long in my life to not feel like this and then now I do so let's take a look at that back you guys are really seeing it before me so let me yeah see you can pretty much see the whole tank top I don't know if I wasn't wearing a bra if you would see that yeah i believe you still would so i would need to use this as a layering piece but i like it it's good and comfy it matches this pretty well so i can see myself keeping this see sometimes it's worth it to keep it because you receive a discount if you buy all five pieces so i've seen myself say hey i don't really want this piece but if i buy the other four pieces and I don't get the 25% off, then I could pay sometimes more than buying all five pieces. And the good thing is, is that Vanessa and I are similar in size. I'm larger than her, but then that just means that if something doesn't fit me well, then it'll probably fit her better because then that means that it probably is too small on me and then maybe it'll fit her better. So the good thing is, is that she loves the clothes like I love the clothes and we have similar styles. So when I don't want something, I'm like, hey lady, you want this? And she's like, yeah. I want that, and then I can get my 25%. Yeah, V, I don't know what you're getting out of this box. This is seriously one of the most comfy shirts ever. Oh my goodness, you guys. Oh, this is like so, it's like cashmere. Oh, I wanna roll around in this. Oh, this is so comfortable. Okay, yes, yes to all of this. This is the outfit that she essentially picked out was these joggers with this shirt. And like I said, I just have my black tank top on underneath that, but that is so cute. I love this so much. I don't wanna take this one off. This is the one that's going back on. I usually wear one walking away from my fix and this one's gonna be it. This one's gonna be it. Oh yeah, this one was so cozy. Oh, whoa, oh, shoes. I almost knocked over the mirror. Okay, Kira, let's not give yourself seven years of bad luck because you like the shirt. This one feels really soft and cozy, too. And I don't have a lot of blue. I don't own a lot of blue. Actually, I don't know if I own any long sleeve blue. And all of these, at least she went back and picked out correctly that, like, it's lightweight. It's long sleeves, but it's long sleeves, lightweight, which is good. I mean, we are coming into our coldest months, January and February, or where it gets real cold here in Texas. I mean, it's like 
there are mornings where you take the kids to school and it's 19 degrees out so i mean that's cold so i definitely wanted something to like i want to be able to get up in the morning because it's always cool in my house too if that makes any sense like our house has air conditioning and stuff so it's always set to like 70 degrees so i want to be able to get up in the morning and throw something like this on and be able to get the lunches ready and then still wear that same thing to go out and not have to bundle up but I really love this. Like, I really, really love this. This is so soft and so, so cozy. And this style is so, so me. Like, look at that junk in the trunk, though. Any shirt that I get like this, even a high-low, like, it just sits on my ass like a shelf. But whatever. Some people pay for that. Me, I'd pay to have someone suck it off. But whatever. It is what it is. But for what I'm working with, you guys, I feel... So cozy. Okay, I'm kind of glad I spoke up and I feel bad, Julie. Don't take this personally because it was not you. I just, you know, Kelly and I had a relationship and she knew me and I felt like she was going to nail everything. But I like, if you're nailing like comfy and cozy, like I think I nailed the comfy cozy. And like I have room to, you know, eat during the holidays, but also like these would be better if they weren't like I have the mom pouch from the three kids three c-sections cutting through your muscles no repair kind of thing but like these would still look these would still fit me if I lost 10 or 15 pounds they would just feel more comfortable so uh yeah I think she did a really really good job oh, I don't know now am I taking this one off and putting the other one yeah I'm still putting the other one back on all right, you guys, it is verdict time. So let's uh, check the prices. I never check the prices beforehand because I feel like sometimes it sways me if something's where I would not normally spend it and then I'm on the fence about it. I'm like, oh no, I don't like it. But if I fall in love with it before I even know the cost, sometimes it's better for me. All right, so that racerback gray shirt is $38. The, uh, this one, this is the Dahlia Brushed Knit Top by Nine Britain. This is in dark pink, which I get that. Uh, it's $44. Wow, that's not bad for this at all. Then the Fortune and Ivy, that's the cardigan. Uh, that's 50 bucks, which is, that's pretty good for a cardigan, especially, again, if you buy all five pieces, you get 25% off. So... 25% off of 50 bucks is 12.50. So now you're talking 37.50 for a cardigan. That's like not bad at all. Um, and then the market and spruce. Oh, that that's the hoodie I just took off. The blue one, yeah, navy it was 42 dollars. That's nothing. And then these joggers are 44 dollars. Wow, this was a really good box. So 218 was the total. And then if you buy all five, you get 54.50 off, making your total 163.50. And so if you take off your 20 dollars, and then I have 50 dollars left over in credit from you guys if you use that link you get $25 and so do I so I have $50 left over from that and so wow that is that's pretty good I will take that so it would be $93.50 for all five of these pieces if I were to choose to keep them and the good thing is, is that you can push this back for like two weeks I think is the maximum amount of time for you to decide whether or not so I usually do that I push it back and then I ask you guys because at five pieces that means I pay less than 20 bucks for each piece and I could say $20 is really all I want to pay for that racer back but $20 for this when this is going to be like my new favorite shirt um that to me is well worth it but i really would love your guys's opinion because sometimes i'm a little hard on myself and then sometimes like i don't see things that you guys see or sometimes you're like oh no kira that is no good and when i get like 50 people who say like hey that's no good i'm like all right 
I wasn't seeing something everybody else was seeing like maybe it's not for me so you guys always help me decide so let me know in the comments below what you think I should keep or not keep or if you think that if I keep all five pieces if it's worth the $93.50 I think it is everything was super cozy like the only thing that was kind of on the fence was that racer back that was the only one that was like eh but let's leave that one out and then add everything else so 44 50 that's 94 98 134 130 so it would be 176 you'd get no discount besides the 70 dollars that i would have my 20 dollars styling fee and my 50 bucks in credit so then you're talking 10650 over 9350. So it would cost me $13.50 more than to just get the whole thing. And there are like Facebook book groups and stuff where you can sell your stitch fix clothes as long as you have tags on them and stuff. So sometimes I've done that just to get my money back. Or like I said, usually I'll sell it to V. She I chart, you know, she pays the 25% less and just pays me for what I take for the shirt and then she'll take it but otherwise I don't know I think that this one was a success so you guys tell me in the comments below but I'm gonna go ahead and clean up this mess and I'm gonna edit this and turn around and put it right up for you guys to see so you guys are seeing me in a live time it is I don't know what time it is however long it took me <laughs> to film this it's probably like 30 minutes later or so so I'm probably pushing on five o'clock so let me go ahead and go and get this edited but I love you guys so so much thank you for watching another vlogmas video if you want to try out stitch fix don't forget to check uh click that link down in the description box and go ahead and give them a try it is like a no-brainer like I said because in the beginning it costs you nothing to try because they waive your fee so it doesn't cost you anything to try you get $25 in credit so if you just kept that racer back shirt it would cost you nine dollars so you just you know stuff like that you can't beat but click that link go ahead give stitch fix a try leave in the comments below what you think of my fix i love you guys so much if this is the last time i see you before christmas merry christmas i hope you have an amazing holiday subscribe if you are new and i will see you in the next one i love you guys bye